Asa Cosby's no stranger to flying long distances in his airplane he keeps at the Kernville Airport. But this summer, he went on a journey of a slower nature. In Kernville, I'm Corey O'Leary, your neighborhood reporter, and this Kern Valley local traveled over a thousand miles on the Pacific Crest Trail this year, and he's not done yet. Uh, big day today, got up early, hiked, got to mile number 1,012. Still can't believe it, I'm like, wow. I walked a thousand miles. Weldon resident Asa Cosby is reflecting about the distance he's hiked this year on the Pacific Crest Trail. Cosby's been charting his progress on his YouTube channel 65 and Alive. My mother is a real inspiration, really. My mom was always, you never want to let a dream go. Cosby's original goal was simpler. Summit Mount Whitney. I climbed Mount Whitney when I was 15 as a Boy Scout on my 15th birthday. I'm going to do it at 65, 50 years later. He looked into getting a permit for the hike. Most people got to come up out of Lone Pine to Whitney Portal Trail, but that's a lotto. You can't just go hike it. However, those hiking on the Pacific Crest Trail, a 2,653 mile long trail that stretches from the Mexican border to the Canadian one, have access to a different trail going up Mount Whitney. I was gonna have to take this back way. And I said, I'm gonna start at the beginning if I'm gonna do that. Gotta go all, go big or go home, you know? <laughs> My first accomplishment is done. I'm home. At age 65, and on day 65 of his hike, he realized his original goal. We left at 12.30 in the morning to do Mount Whitney because we wanted to get there at sunup. And we got there at 5.25 a.m. 14,505 feet at sunrise. I got up there, the wind was ripping, it was colder, and I'm like 65 and alive, you know, I made it. He continued on his hike, which was primarily done alone, but his daughter traveled to join him for certain sections. It's amazing having her with me, and it, and you can you can see it in the videos if you watch the ones when she's involved. It's the trail is so much happier. Woo! Mandy, any closing words? Good night. And I hate mosquitoes. And he's not finished. It's calling me, man. <laughs> the mountains are calling. I spoke with him late July when he came back home to rest for a week. But in early August, he resumed his hike where he left off at Sonora Pass. I'm hoping to make the halfway point, 1325. I like bridges. He says it's been a hard but life-changing journey and has advice for anybody who wants to take on the Pacific Crest Trail. It's hard. Climbing, climbing. But it, there's not an age limit. You can do it. You can do it. He's just one foot in front of the other. Corey O'Leary, 23 ABC News.